We recently unboxed the two new best mid-range flagships, the Xiaomi Redmi Note 4 and the Lenovo Moto G5 Plus. And we saw many things in common. The Snapdragon 625 chipset, Arduino 506 GPU, 3 GB of RAM and many more. So let's check out the performance of the two devices at opening up apps and RAM management as well. With that being said, let's get started. In the start, we see that both the phones have 3 GBs of RAM. Now proceeding to the clock. Clearing all the apps in the background, here we start with the speed test. Now in the start, we see that the Redmi Note 4 is slightly ahead than the Moto G5 Plus. And both the phones are almost at neck to neck. Both the phones right now are on Amazon. And also now on Flipkart. And both the phones are on the same place at the same time. Both the phones are right now loading subway surfers and Moto G5 Plus has taken a slight lead over the Redmi Note 4. Temporan 2 on both the phones is running. Moto G5 Plus goes slightly ahead and proceeds to YouTube. And after YouTube, it is gone on the Play Store as well. And it finishes the first lap at 53 seconds, followed by the Redmi Note 4 at 57 seconds. Now, in the second lap, we see because of the first lap's lead, Moto G5 Plus is ahead. And it has almost every app open in the background. Also, the Redmi Note 4 has all the apps open in the background. And the Moto G5 Plus finishes it at 1 minute and 11 seconds followed by the redmi note 4 at 1 minute and 14 seconds concluding that both the phones are almost at equal speeds i cannot say that the moto g5 plus one it was just a difference of two seconds and that hardly matters in day-to-day -day usage so in the end i can say that the redmi note 4 and the moto g5 plus are almost equal the Snapdragon 625 chipset, the Arduino 506 GPU, 3 GBs of RAM on both the phone performs fantastic. Concluding that be it the Moto G5 Plus or the Redmi Note 4, whatever you buy, you'll not have any problem. Smash the like button guys because that really helps and do subscribe to the channel because that means the world to us. With that being said, this is Scarefear from Noise, signing out.